Good day, ladies and gents. Today we are testing the most Russian uh, dessert ever possible. Alonka chocolate bar. All the Tarkovians dream of it and only a few can actually taste it. And that's exactly what we're gonna do today. So I've got a couple of them. Um, I got different chocolate bars. All of them have uh, unique flavors, right? All right, you can, you can see them right there. I got some more. Then I got some small sweets, some small chocolates, right? I have a really strange uh, square Alenka. Then I got some uh, Alenkas in a package that are more like, I don't know, Kinder, Kinder Paradise or Kinder Delice or something. Then we have Alenka cookies. And then we have uh, Alenka... How do, you, how do you call this thing? A sweet roll. Apparently this is called a sweet roll. So that's what we're going to be having today. And to make sure I stay hydrated, I got myself a bottle. A huge bottle of water. It looks, it looks to something similar in Tarkov, right? It clearly reminds me of something. And in order to compare all of the flavors, we have a tier list, which is right there. Boom. We're going to fill it while I'm tasting them. So without further ado, let's start. The best way of starting is definitely starting with the original flavor. I decided to go for a small chocolate bar because it looks very cute and sweet. They are available in different sizes. This size, um, da, 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 the usual size. And there's also a extra large size. It's like this big. I didn't manage to find it, but it does exist. So let's open it up. sweet sugar instantly flows into your brain fulfills you with energy it's definitely not the expensive type of the chocolate if you know how lint tastes like it's nothing like this you can see that this is kind of a cheaper type of chocolate but it still tastes nice overall nothing unique tastes all right i would probably put it somewhere around the b tier if i'm honest so let's keep it there for now and secondly we're gonna try a very similar flavor Man, it's so easy to lose them. I don't even know where they are. A lot of milk and a lot of calcium. It's kind of funny how they say calcium, like calcium is the flavor. You can't really taste calcium, can you? All right, let's give this one a go. Not gonna lie, I don't know if there is much of a difference, but I like the previous one better. More or less the flavor is the same. Maybe it's a bit more milky, but original tastes better. All right, next one is Alenka with funny things. This is actually what it says. Visilinki, which is like funny, laughy, I don't know. It's fun and laugh related. So maybe it's gonna make us laugh. Maybe I'm gonna become as happy as she is in the picture. Let's give it a go. All right, it looks really interesting because you can see the AKA funny things on the on the back of the chocolate. And they also have something, they also have something on the front, like She's like walking somewhere. I don't know. Anyway, let's try the funny things. See if it makes me laugh. <laughs> no, it it did not make me laugh. However, I really enjoyed the inside, which is a milky, milky stuff. It really reminds me of uh, a Kinder chocolate bar. It has the same flavor as the Kinder chocolate bar, but it doesn't really have that Kinder aftertaste, if you know what I'm talking about. Overall, I like it. I think I would put it into the... A tier list and we also forgot to put this one this one is somewhere in between B and C let's put it here next one is uh, strawberry Alonka with strawberry it lo also looks like it has that milky filling so I wonder if it's gonna taste like kinder as well all right this one is awful it tastes disgusting I don't know what kind of chemicals they use for that one what kind of gem they used this is definitely going into the D tier It doesn't taste much like Kinder, and the strawberry doesn't taste like strawberry either. This is bad, like real bad. Alright, since we started talking about fruits and berries, let's do the banana one. Looks exactly the same inside, just with different color gem or whatever it is. Banana does taste better than strawberry, however, this banana reminds me of vape. 
you know whenever you vape banana or eat something with artificial banana flavoring it all tastes the same and i feel like they have the same thing in the chocolate it's a super artificial flavor and for that reason we're gonna put it into the c list there we go see that's where you belong all right you know what let's take a small break from chocolate bars and let's eat alenka sweet those ones are usually being sold by grams so you grab a couple of them just like this you put them in a pack you weigh them and then you paid for you pay for the weight pack is like a double inside by the way with the with the silver thing okay so that's the chocolate sweet mm. very crispy very easy to break as soon as you bite into it you get the nut flavor mm. maybe some almonds maybe some other you know like wood type of nuts so yeah if you like these nuts you should definitely try this one out even though I'm not the biggest nuts fan, I can give this one an A tier for sure. Great, so you know what? I'm actually gonna finish this one. It's pretty nice. Oh yeah, if you still haven't given this video a thumbs up, thumbs up for my diabetes. Yay. Yeah, by the way, I don't have diabetes and I don't want to get one. All right, our next Alonka comes in a square package and it actually comes with hazelnut. Let's crack into it very easy to open i love this pack because the pack is very wide right on those two sides it's very easy to open it and very easy to hold it big big like for this thing mm. super soft as soon as you bite into it it just it just melts and breaks down like it doesn't exist probably you can squash it into like one millimeter thickness i would put this one i would say between s and eight here out of all the stuff I tried, this is so far my favorite. Let's put it into the S tier. I think I think it does belong to the S tier. Oh man, I don't want to eat them anymore. <laughs> I don't want to eat them anymore. But we're going to do it anyway. The video has to be done. And while we're in the middle of the video, I want to take a small break. You know, let my sugar levels go down. So thanks uh, to my channel members for the support. Mr. Sergo, LL, LL, brother. Um... And Christian, thank you so much for being supporters of the channel. I appreciate it. So yeah, if you want to support the channel in an additional way, you can always uh, subscribe to it. Если у кого из русскоговорящей аудитории есть желание поддержать, я завел Boosty. Я не очень часто говорю на русском, но я вижу ваши комменты, я их читаю. Спасибо, что смотрите, ребят. Alonkas are not gonna eat themselves, are they? Oh my lord, this is scary. Look at her face. It's not like I am gonna eat her. It's like she's gonna eat my insides. All right, so those are cookies, cookies with uh, cocoa beans. Apparently, there are plenty of vitamins as well, B1, B6, and PP. So if you eat this thing, your PP is gonna grow. All right, it looks scarier than I thought. All right, one of my cookies broke. Bro, it looks like death. It doesn't look like Ilonka, it looks like death, so it looks like a skull. All right, let's think back the fact that she broke. Tastes like a typical Russian cookie. I couldn't really feel much uh, cocoa. Sandy flavor. Mm. I also think it's pretty expensive in the shop, to be honest. So, yeah. Um, we're gonna put this into, into B. B list. Next chocolate... <coughs> Next chocolate bar is called Sweet Mosaic. It kind of looks like M&M's to me, and that's what I expect it to be. So there's nothing on the back side, it's pretty clean, but if you look on the front, you can kind of see them peeking through. Little cheeky mosaics. All right, while I was chewing it, this sweet mosaic was cracking under my teeth in a very funny way. And that's it. It felt like the chocolate is not really milky, it's more of a dark chocolate. Mosaic didn't taste like anything, it was just cracking on my teeth. This is so far the worst one, this is an E. This clearly goes to the E. Actually bad. Okay, man. This bar is pretty big. Look at this. It's, it's much bigger than the other ones. Well, much longer to be specific. This one comes with hazelnut and caramel. And it also comes in a really, really funny chocolate packs. Let's see if I like this one. Okay. First of all, pretty thick and difficult to break down. There we go. There is our little piece of chocolate um mm. 
So first of all, every single little square has a single piece of hazelnut inside. So whenever you bite into it, you're being greeted by milky flavor, then you crack into the hazelnut, you get the hazelnut flavor, and the aftertaste is caramel. This is definitely an S tier. Big, big surprise for me. Very tasty. Love it. I also love the uniqueness of this chocolate due to the fact that every single piece has a small hazelnut inside. Very good choice. All right, we got three left. Let's finish with this one. This one comes with hazelnut and uh, dried out grapes. Actually, I forgot the name of that one. But yeah, this is dried out grapes and hazelnut. And the package of this one is very paperish. I guess same as the original one. No, no, they're different. This one has a very unique packaging. I, ca I can't really explain it. So this one is very glittery, as you can see, very shiny. But this one, it's, it feels like sanded kind of paper. Like, you know, if people were to sell chocolate, I don't know, 50 years ago, they would sell it in this kind of package. Very, very nice touch. But we're here not for the touch, we're here for the flavor. All right, I guess I know why people aren't using this packaging anymore. I tried to open it and this is, this is how it ended, chat. <laughs> Bro. Hazelnut doesn't have as much flavor as in the previous chocolate. Couldn't feel the grapes either. But overall, I can't complain about this one too much. Maybe it's just not for me. I can give it a B tier. <clears throat> Alright, now we have two big boys left. We've got the sweet roll, which looks like that. And then we have uh, biscuit, biscuit cakes. So, let's start with a roll. I'm gonna open it up and probably try it with a spoon. I'm not gonna bite it to, into it, because I want to keep it as clean as possible. Because I don't know how long it's going to take me to, to eat the rest of them. I feel like I'm going to be eating this for the rest of the month. Here is our sweet roll. I don't mind it too much. Sweet roll. Tastes good. Has flavor. Milky chocolate as they said. Very soft. Melts in your mouth if you drink tea or water afterwards. I would say that's an A tier. A tier. There we go. And now for the final boss. A huge pack of biscuit cakes. It does look kind of similar to one of the Kinder Bars. Soft, good packaging, easy to store, probably a bit overpriced. Flavor is mad. I, I couldn't feel any flavor. It was just sweet. May maybe, maybe it's because I ate a lot of chocolate already. The only thing which I could mention is that whenever you get to the middle of the cake, it's got that pretty um sour aftertaste like you know there are some sweets and cookies with alcohol like if you bite into them that's kind of flavor you get kind of it's, it's a bit difficult to explain yeah i would give it a uh, b b tier maybe on a good day in a tier so somewhere somewhere in between let me know down in the comments below which one of those sweets you would love to try and yeah i think we're coming to an end of a video i ate too much chocolate i need some i need some break now and yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy content like this. I'll keep making Tarkov food videos. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you check out my platforms, I stream daily on Twitch. And feel free to check out those videos. Those are the videos from your recommendations. I don't know what they are. Um, and yeah, I'll see you in the next one.